A very good morning and welcome back. We are back with the discussion of the day just as I promised you to keep promise to Natenda. Yu ndiyo tabia yetu wapa Y254. My name is Sankara Kayesu and this is Y in the morning on a WCW. So the talk of today, the talk of the day today, we are going to talk about girls and standards. Eh? I don't know how I can put that in Kiswahili. Maybe one of these people, the Abantus, they are going to help me put it in Kiswahili. But I can jaribu waschana na viwango viwango. Ama vijiwango vijiwango. I know about it. My name is Ankara Kayesu and I'm not alone in studio. I am with girls. The girls who are going to help me dissect this. I am with Desi and Diana. See you? Yeah. Uh, the Ds. Eh? <laughs> the Ds. Uh, I don't know whether this D has to do with anything, but let's start with uh, Diana. Diana, tell us everything that you think we need to know about you, your name, you, where you come from, what you do, your social media handles, and everything. This is your camera here. Hello, uh, my name is Diana. I'm from Mombasa, Pwani University, currently in Mombasa Aviation. I'm an intern in KBC and my social media handles um, Nikki Girl at Instagram and uh, Diana Nikita at Facebook. Ungesema hivyo na Kiswahili nisikie umombasa in it. I would be happy. Kwa majina naitwa Diana, natoka Mombasa. Uh, nasomea hapo ni university lakini kwa muda huu niko katika huku huko huko siko huko niko hapa KBC nilikuwa nataka tu kusikia Kiswahili ya pwani nilikuwa naona nataka useme mimi na, naitwa Diana natoka pwani hizo <laughs> <laughs> vitu <laughs> sio lazima mtu aongee hivyo <laughs> <laughs> okay thank you and welcome to white five thank you yeah this we were with you on this set sometime back around how many years ago? Yeah, I think that that is like 2018, 2017. Yes. That's like, uh, I don't know, four, five years. Yes, and yeah. we were hosted by DJ Piera. DJ Piera Makena, yeah. You and I were panelists, were guests. Yeah, yeah. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah. Katamu, hey, Katamu yeah. Kabisa, yeah, I missed yeah. you. Yeah, thank well, you. How have you been all these years? Oh, I've been okay. Yeah. Managing, hapa kule, hapa kule. Umekua wapi? Ah, uh, shugli, kazi, na mm. all that. Mm. Yeah. Now tell people who are seeing you for the first time, who are not the majority, who you are and oh. what you do and all that. Okay, my name is Daisy Wanjiko Mahera, uh, the former student leader, KCA Women Representative, that is from 2016-2017. But now I'm a finance manager at Textile Limited. We deal with uh, interior and exterior moldings for houses. So mkitaka mnakuja. Ah. Hiyo hapo kwa interior molding. Mhm. Mm na hizo vitu zote. Ah, wacha hiyo tutarudia baadaye. Mm -hmm. Tufanye tu ulikuja hapa ukiwa student leader mimi pia nilikuwa student leader. Exactly. So you are here student leader yes, and you yes. are panelists like both of us. Yes. Now you are working. Eh? Yes. Unazaishi nyumba unaza date mtu anaishi nyumba aina floor like si una deal na vitu interior yes. yeah mad house tu yenye aina floor unaza date <laughs> mtu kama we. okay for me dating is a two way thing it's not necessarily about what you have cuz uh, from uh, from someone who is independent and everything it's about the connection between you and the guy it's not necessarily where he lives or where he comes from. It's about the attachment between me and you. Sure. Money in Akuja Badai. Sure. Yes. Are you being honest? Yes, I am very honest. Okay. Yes. Diana, <laughs> Unaza we are in university students. Unaza date mtu a class two. Mwenyali drop out class two. To be honest, CSE CSE date mtu a class two. I may drop <laughs> class two. Uh, no, it's it's um <clears throat> for example like Saini kwa university. Yes. And I, I have education, I am learned. Yes. And then and I And I think you also have money. <laughs> see, <laughs> <laughs> okay, see, financially, financially free. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you. Yes. So, see, the end I kachukua kijana wa for I'm a drop from class two. Eh. I, I see you, Toto. Like, I drop class two, like, 
20 years ago. Okay. Yeah, so say ni aged too, but I did express na English vizuri kwa sababu wa kufika huko <laughs> na like ajui like uh, ni mtu wa class 2. Okay. English na hizo zingine doesn't matter in love kwa sababu I think kama li drop class 2 20 years ago maybe he has done something. Eh yeah, ame, amefanya yeah, labda u, ku, yeah, jab, labda amefanya mambo yeah. wakati huu tunapongea labda ako mkubwa mahali yeah. alijalishi Oh, ni ukubwa unaangalia. Hapana, hapana. Okay, okay. okay we'll, you we'll need come. to get somebody who can support you and you can support him. This is how it is. It's a, it's a two-way traffic. Well, I can support him, he can support me, and we can move on. For example, nikikuwa na mtu haizi ni support. Yeah. Not only financially or um, kwa mawazo, kwa vitu naitaji, I need support from my man. So, kama sinita kwa na mtu na ani support, itakuwa ngumu sana ku sustain the relationship. Diana, you, if you are keen, uh -huh. you've noticed something. Uh -huh. You are talking education. Yeah, meanda pesa. Uh -huh. Support. Vitu kama hizo. Uh -huh. So, it's like, uh, wasichana wanaangalia pesa sana. To an extent that the standards are too high for men, for us. Uh, let me give you a typical example. Uh, recently, kulikuwa na debate kali Kenya, uh, where viazi iliesha kwa somewhere kwenye zili kwanga, mm -hmm. kwenye uwa mnakula. Mm -hmm. Where chips is very expensive. Mm -hmm. Well, the same chips unaweza tengeneza na waru kutoka kirinyaga, na mtaki iyo. So, meres class, to an extent that vitu za class inaisha kwa stock, adi mnabaki sasa hakuna vile mta survive why are you making life so hard for men okay for me i can say uh, not setting the standards high because the, the problem with nowadays is uh, once the women were empowered the men were not taught how to deal with the empowered woman mm. that's why they usually say u de manaringa i said in kuringa it's because she knows what she wants She's independent. She knows uh, everything. Yani kenye wu utafanya kaesu, mm. ndo hata mi nitafanya, unona. Mm, mm. But hatu kuonyesha, yani boy child, haijonyesha kudeal with the empowered woman. Mm -hmm. Yes, that is all I can say. Na si sasa inaleta shida kusababu, walo wenye wenye awajakuwa eh, taught kudeal with the empowered women, mm -hmm. ndiyo waku. Mesikia, mwesikia, sisi ndiyo tuko. Sisi ndiyo tuko, sisi ndiyo tuko. Sasa, kama wao ndiyo wako, utafanya nini? Utafanya nini? Una ngana nao? I have in my hand here mm -hmm. uh, a research work mm -hmm. that shows that wasichana wenye wame soma kabisa to a level of master's PhD wanakosa watu wa kuwaoa. Hey. We uko na uko karibu kupata degree sasa hii. Si naona uko in danger. Utapata mtu. I want your reaction on that. No, in nitapata mtu. Wanaume ni wengi. <laughs> Tunaambua wanaume ni wa ni wa chache. Ni wa chache. Yeah. Lakini yeah. kulingana na kusoma si eti ukisoma uwezi pata mtu. Mm. Unaweza pata mtu. But you need research. Ni, okay, I know research is a same, mm. lakini logically mm. uneza pata mtu kabisa. Kwa sababu, ailinga ni kwa eti ni mesoma, ni kwa naelimu, kwa hivyo siezi olewa. Well, wanawake wanao, wanaokuwa wanajitegemea, wanafanya mambo yao wenye, wana business, wako empowered, ni ngumu kupata mwanaume. Kwa sababu, wanaume, wanataka mwana... Kwa mfano, ni, ni mekua katika dating, Na mwanaume anakombia, mimi nataka ni kwa nyumba, ni kufanya kila kitu. Sasa mimi nilienda shuleni, ni kasoma, ni kafanya kila kitu. Ndiyo nije ni fanya kazi, hangalata mimi ni jitegeme, lakini anataka kwa nyumba, akufanya kila kitu. Ambao ni mambo ya kitambo ya lipito na wakati. Tuko katika generation mpya sai. Kwa hivyo, tunaposema kuwa eti, ni ngumu kupata mwanaume, utapata mwanaume, lakini ni ni mwanaume anataka kufanya nini ama mnataka kufanya nini pamoja basi mm. to, see, to switch roles if that is what you want nikae kwa nyumba nifanye kila kitu utafute pesa is that possible also <laughs> si possible <laughs> <laughs> tuongee mambo na masomo sasa mambo na masomo yeah, what girls, i can girls 
wanakosa wanaume wakishasoma the main reason mm-hmm. according to this research is mm-hmm. that you guys want people who are like like minded with you who are in the same level with education and thinking capacity with you mm-hmm. yet wakifika huko wanapata kama washachukuliwa wote men also reach there <laughs> but wanapita kama already they have people they mm-hmm. have maybe a male's family vitu kama hizo most of you anaenda tu kishafika huko ndo na sema eh masomo enough let me look for a man na mnakosa sasa when we are looking at both sides of the coin eh? okay there is that uh, woman who is independent sasa yeye standards of course ziko high venye unasema so pia anaangalia yani mind yake iko so focused una imagine amesoma all that so dealing with someone who is reasoning the same way this person is reasoning inakuwa inakuwa shida unapata maybe in terms of reasoning they are not reasoning the same so that's why you find this woman she she has all the money and a drive i at her there's a certain i, I think psychiatrist uh, psychology mm. person who was mm. saying i won't quote he was saying that those women unapata haizi pata mwanamme kwa sababu number one, maybe she's riding mwenyewe utamuona wapi Mm-hmm. Seme mwanamme mwenyewe umetoka Kibera unatembea. Huu mm-hmm. mwanamke from wa kurudi ni gari. Hata hiyo inaonekana sanga. Na nimewahi jaribu kuomba lift kwa kwa wasiana kama hao. <laughs> Tunaona so wezi mpata. Ukiomba tu lift wanapandisha kio. Exactly. Then she'll complain she doesn't get a man. Number two is those people who are so beautiful. Kayo suko na msana mrembo kabisa utakatia utaanza kusema eh udem ni msupu sana unaona? Eh unaona eh standards au dem siwezi fikia. Mm. Na maybe hata uki try by the funny enough they they wana yani huwa wanaingia kwa relationship haraka sana. Cuz wanangojanga that one person to approach her but there is not that person cuz unaogopa utaki deny you know men you fear your rejection so utaki kuambiwa eh hey, ah, ah. you see I have a friend yes mwenye ali post na i really felt for him mm-hmm. ati yako na shida ame approach them akijua u dem atakubali mm-hmm. but dem amekubali so ako kwa shida juu yafanye nini like yes. them ameingia box na kwa anatarajia alikuwa anajaribu tu like eh ni aje si nipenda namba yako alafu akampea namba alafu akamin box ukoaje can we go out huyo akaingia vizuri aka slide kwa hiyo box Shh. niko twende yes. wapi na naona kama hizi standard ya udema hizi maintain eh si sasa hii kwa kujiweka mrembo sana pia ni mbaya si ujiweke tu katikati sasa utajekaji katikati ka Yesu. Everyone wants to look good. You want to look good. I want to look good. She wants to look good. So you can't put yourself <laughs> down at it so that you can match with the with the mm. status quo. Yes. Yes. But there are still women hata unaweza pata dem anaenda kibera na gari. Tumeona yeah. wangapi yeah. mpaka tunauliza eh hey, huyu wa, akona nini and you know what that yeah. person has. Oh. Unajua ni nini anampea. Yes. So oh, those things that we can't say Yes. Oh. So don't say that at at our madem they usually ride there. Kibera unatoka mm. pata mtu mpaka madhare na gari mpaka kwa chali. Oh. Yes. Let's speak it from there. Can you if maybe it's good in other things ni pesa na elimu wana but it's good on other things then zenye desi ataki tuseme hapa. See you can make a man out of him. You cannot make a man out of somebody but he can make himself a man out of himself. Wewe si mmolda kwa mwanaume wenye unataka. Naweza mold lakini kama ataki kukua hivyo. Je, nita mold? Nani anasema ataki? <laughs> si anaweza ataka tu we but are, ni, we are ni vile ana pesa, uh-huh. ana education. Mm-hmm. So you can provide this eh uh, umrudisha shule umfungulie biashara eh uh, umpe tudo umpe ganji umpe to like uh, Unaona hii 200,000 eh that manage this. Unaweza? Taking it from there, mm. niko na rafiki yangu. So she she works but then ako na mwanaume mwenye afanye kazi. And ana provide ana provideia huyo mwanaume kila kitu. Ame anamtumia pesa, nunua hii, eka kwa nyumba, fanya hivi, akamfungulia paka biashara. Akamwambia nataka ufanye hiyo biashara, mimi hata sitahitaji kitu chochote kutoka kwako. Unaona? So The man instead of doing all this he takes the money drinks and akunywa pombe and nini nini hakuna kitu kwa nyumba in fact he stays in a three, in 
in any room mm. only mm. you know the only room and a car mm. the rest of the money it i usually can in end up so the lady from ukwa mekuja anangoja akuja one like mtu amejenga amefanya kitu ya maana amefika there was nothing completely unajua so she was so disappointed yes you tell me that i can mold this man but he's he ready to be molded Mm. Ako tayari kwa molded. If he's not ready then you cannot move forward with this person. Then unaona angali kama if he's ready. Anaangalia kama if he's not ready like anaangalia from the negative lens. Mm. Kwa ukimpea pesa atakunywa. Mm. Eh angali kwa ukimpea labda hiyo atajenga. Si negativity pia inawaua nyinyi. Lakini kwa Yesu mi I believe ni personality. Unaona? Mm. If you love love. <laughs> mold to Ya yeah, kifika mahali aende ni sawa cuz your conscience will always be clean. Kwa ulimsaidia. You ulimsaidia yeah. maybe akapata pesa ama akafika place yenye alitaka na yeah. akaenda. Auta feel wasted? No. If Uta if you if you're an empathist, yeah. you won't feel anything. Oh. Yes. So it depends with the personality. Kwa uta feel <laughs> at least you made an impact kumsaidia yes. utafeel akishampea pesa alafu aende ukishampea pesa umjenge um move from one stage of kama life to another alafu aende kama uliko unampenda yeah. and then something like that happen of course utafeel something like honestly to be honest utafeel something like well yeah. i did a lot yeah. i helped like unajua but it's okay you did an impact you you helped him what I end mm. there's still more to come so maybe okay. mungu alikuwa anataka um, maybe alikuwa destined kuwe part of him ndio mm. afike mahali fulani yeah. muachane yeah. Yes. yeah that's nice yes. now let's get to the question of the day unaweza pelekwa date kibandaski yeah <laughs> definitely <laughs> yes ukule gideri hapo na actually na that's i can do that because i don't really th- Kibandaski ni, ni kibandaski to its food still. Kando ya barabara like mkotuka ndo ya barabara aweke supu ya maragwe na chapo. Mkule tu hapo ipo kabisa alafu you call it a date like amekupeleka out vizuri. Well there are those who wish to be taken to places like that and I enjoy pelekwa. Oh. So nikipelekwa nitashukuru like well amefanya bidii. I'm, at least that's how he can show my he can show that he loves me. Eh. Unajua si lazima kupeleke kwa hotel kubwa sijui pizza in eh. na ana uwezo. Uwezo wake hapo ndo unafika. Kwa hivyo oh. wacha akinipeleka hapo nitashukuru kwa sababu ameonesha effort kuwa ananipenda na anaonesha upendo. Oh. Nice. Nambie <coughs> this. The same question. <laughs> Kibandaski it depends na ni time gani na ni wapi. Mm. Unaona? Mm. So kuna time maybe unaweza pele kwa kibandaski juu mtu amekudharau. Unajua pia mtu anaweza kuwa amekudharau. Eh. Eh. Madharau. Si ndio? Like mtu akupeleka kibandaski kwa sababu amekudharau. Si ndio? I have not I have not For thought real? about that. Yes, mtu anaweza kupeleka kibandaski juu maybe amekuwa na unafa hiyo kibandaski. So ina depend pia <laughs> na ule tali amekubeba aji. Kibandaski ina shida but huo tali ndio akupeleke pale. Mm amekubeba aji hiyo ndio shida kwa wewe unaona tu madharau hapo unaona madharau unaona madharau unaona mtu akikupeleka kibandaski amekubeba eh unaona tu madharau kidogo eh okay tuseme ume unaishi for two bedroom kama hali two bedroom alafu mtu ana kuna ana kudate ako na kasingul tu yenye unaenda cho nje eh can you just accept him the way he is um i can accept him the way he is but he will have to change after some time because <laughs> that's a that's not a way apana hakuna mtu ana uwezo ni effort una make mwanaume ni effort una unajituma unatafuta uwezi niambia mimi nitakuwa na, na kualika kwangu ukikuja hata wewe uta feel like eh Enye, I need to do something you know cuz nitakualika kwangu utakuja ni two bedroom alafu wewe ukinialika nikikuja kwako ni single room hicho ni nje usitakuwa una feel you feel the guilty and the, um, apaka una make effort so una make effort una move kwa hiyo kwa hiyo nyumba 
Unaza mwezesha asonge. I asked you when you were starting if you can visit somebody. In, have you dated somebody staying in, you know how Kibera houses look? Have you ever gotten yes, into one I of have. those? Yeah, ni sakafu ni soil tu. Soil tu kama hii ya kutambea nje. Alafu unaweza pata hapo ndani pia ni hivyo tu. Uh -huh. But your person working in uh, kwenye si kwenye mko mnafanya mna work na vitu like uh, tiles um, mm -hmm. inside deco. Yeah. So, so you can use that position to improve life yake. Umjenge. Sasa shida inakuwa hapa. Umsaidie alafu tena akuepe. Hivyo venye tu tulikuwa unasema. But no, you need, we need to be optimists, not pessimists. <laughs> yeah? Okay, like, me, I wouldn't to mind. We have to debate mm -hmm. to was, uh, on a clean note that nothing wrong will happen. That is what we call optimism. Mm -hmm. Pessimism, mm -hmm. ni ile unafikiria, eh, hey, ni kifanya hivi, atafanya hivi. <laughs> si tukue tu positive kuwa, say, na hata ukimsaidia, mm -hmm. na hata akuache, si you will be proud kuwa you've at least improved somebody's life. Okay, maybe some years back I would, but right now I can't. Can you explain why? <laughs> because life changes. I'm a ukonaka experience. Somebody nobody could tell me. Maybe where's the jua? Where's the jua? Yes. So maybe, maybe not. But mm. uh, in, as I told you earlier, it's about people. Mm. It's not about the house you live in. Mm. Because at all, Talia, maybe I go to your single room. Nim to a corner, a lot of potential. So, where's he a kind to wastage? Utakatu apo, mvumiliane, sawa. Akiskia monya taenda ni save ni tutu likwa tunongia before. But it's good for you, you'll feel okay. Yes. Okay, you'll feel some pinch at some point, but your conscience will be clean. Because at the end of the day, ulipenda umtu, ukeenda kwa hiyo single, ukangangana na yeye, mm. maybe afike mahali fulani. Na life ni stage. Penye ulikuwa some five years ago is not where you are right now. There was a very positive story last year here in Kenya about mm -hmm. this athlete called Omanyala. Did you hear it? Omanyala is now the fastest person in Africa. Mm -hmm. He sprints 100 meters. Mm -hmm. And uh, <coughs> Faith hosted his wife sometime back here. Faith is the lady who was hosting before I, we came here. And uh, Omanyala himself told the story of how this lady used to give her money. Fair, akienda training, akifanya nini, like oh, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah. food, and beba, and nayo training. By then, awakujua Omanyala anaza kwaji na inajuli kana hapa Kenya. But I'm supportive also on Omanyala when he was addressing the nation, said that, uh, you see, my girlfriend took care of me while I had nothing. So it's a time to enjoy. I will give her everything she needs. Like even two days ago, she came here and she was okay. She says, I lack nothing now. Mm. I am staying in a, a good house. Courtesy of my husband, the person of my boyfriend, I think our Jawana, I took care of him when he had nothing. Now he's taking care of me. See, unaona hiyo ni success story. Una ezafanya kitu kama hiyo. Nezafanya, well... Iyo kunyamaza kwanza, <laughs> kunyamaza no, kwanza, inamandisha tu kitu. Genuinely, inside eh. your heart, if you can do it. So yes, nezafanya. Lakini sasa, unajua, kuna kuanga na disappointments tu, bado. Hata hivyo venye wako, uneza kujo kakuto, uka, uka sikia tu, something happened. Unajua, they, they are not any more together. But it's life. Mm. This path is just not straight. It has so many curves. So... Uki, ukiacho, unakubali, una move on. You can find another one still, umjenge, um, um build, but then something else. Unaza jenga wangabi. Does he comment on this Omanyala? Hey, yeah, ya <laughs> Omanyala, okay, mine za sema, uo demi yake alikuwa patient. That, that is a strong woman to begin mm -hmm, with. She's mm -hmm. a very strong woman. Yeah, she came on a segment called Strength of a Woman. Yes, she's yeah. a strong woman because dealing with someone who... Who, is, who has maybe you're trying to build that man is not a joke. Mm. With the generation we, ha we have today. Mm. Say, tutakwambi, and maybe that's what we end up with situation to easy. 
Mm. Yes, maybe we can say ati tuneza saidia mtu afike hiyo state na maybe auwezi. Mm. Ba sasa shida inakuwa character development. Mm. Unatandikwa vizuri. <laughs> yes. Kuna <laughs> <laughs> kitu inaitwa peer influence. <laughs> Diana. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu your sister date somebody of some class or kwa sababu your deskmate friend there at the campus date somebody of some class. So wewe una reject wanaume wenye wanakuja wenye wako a bit lower you look on what what do you drive uh, which places do you walk into alafu hii pia influence na kuharibia hadi sasa upati ama unapata wrong person mwenye labda ako huko but is very abusive like atakupiga ako na gari ako na Mercedes Benz ako na V8 but anakupiga ama anakuwa abuse ama na ku embarrass mbele ya watu si si sasa unaona ina pia inaribu wasichana yeah i think influence pia inaribu wasichana kwa sababu unataka kufikia standard ya yule mwenye yule mwenye mnatembea pamoja like my friends ah uh, ana date mtu ako na gari mtu ako na ako na nyumba kubwa amejenga ako na kazi kwa ofisi ni lawyer so your, your standards are your aiming your standards so high that wezi jua kama utapata huyu mtu you end up getting somebody mwenye maybe atakuwa abuse kwa sababu and then unavumilia juu unaona nikimwacha nika, nika sana nitaenda wapi mm. na ushazoea mm. juu anakupea doa anakufanyia nini sasa anakubeba na gari wenza kwa kidrop na gari sio uta, utakuja na miguu na wilbaro na, <laughs> <laughs> na wilbaro sasa <laughs> so, 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 the influence from others pia ina affect a lot in this in this generation because mm. unataka eh nifikie hiyo standard I injeri akidropua na gari hata mimi nitadropua na gari. Mm. So, no, this is the the basics like mm. Mm. which is not good. Wewe ulikuwa student leader. Mm Hizi -hmm. shida uliona? Za za peer influence like mtu ana debt mtu mkubwa mwenye ako na pesa. So other girls also wanataka wafike hapo so they can fall for anything. Yeah, influence iko kila mahali. Iko in terms of friendship, iko in, in terms of social media. Sa ukiona hao watu wana date maybe watu wako na pesa kina sponsors eh unaona life yao iko sawa so unapata msichana na jindald na a lot of bad things which is not a good thing she doesn't mind that he, kuna nini diseases kuna whatever yeah, you know yeah. so it's such a shame to to see that especially in campus mm. there's a lot a lot a lot mm. you find yourself by the time umemaliza uli influenceiwa na maybe uli drop out in the middle ju maybe uli pata ball mm. uli pata disease mm. na sat so influence it is very high especially mm. in campus kwa ndio ufike hiyo hiyo class so watu wanaenda up kuharibu maisha yes yes yeah, to add on that there's someone i know ako kwa relationship and then like uh, the, the the partner says uh, we need to find someone else so that we can be three like like unajua unaelewa hmm. so I was, yeah i was uh, like <laughs> how do you how do you yeah, how do you even start it like how do you even manage unajua <laughs> <laughs> and then you wewe ni ni dem afu umevumilia tu kwa hapo juu huyu mtu ako na pesa hmm. na anakwambia ni hivi na hivi na ni lazima ikuwe hivi unajua hmm. ni lazima ukubaki hapo kwa sababu sasa umeshazoea your life hmm. and then huyu mtu anakuprovidea hmm. and to make matters worse uja, you have nothing at all like you cannot even struggle juu umezoea kupewa tu kwa hmm. tu sasa hmm. unakubali anything that the person says you are there okay fine okay. yeah okay. na labda unaweza pata mtu mwenye ko chini mm, exactly but yeah. but is good is decent so hizi ma standard pia na class zina haribu maisha za watu si zina haribu standard ina depend sasa tuseme kama hiyo ya ya campus that one ina spoil life ya mwanamke lakini standard yenye mwanamke amejitaftia it's the best oh yes it's Sia the kupata. best si akupata kwa sponsor ile mm. yeye ametama amenangana mm. shule maybe aka, akapata ka job kapoa mm. that that that, that way is same at in a mess but ile unatafuta kwa mwanamme especially our tunona generation yetu saa hii na sponsors that is where nini ladies get distracted and they mess their lives let's discuss what we mostly see in nigerian movies especially nigerian mm -hmm. movies umependa jamaa na hana kitu 
na maparo wamekata kwa huyo that's not person to bring in this family they do everything they can do everything to make sure that we separate na huyo jamaa unaweza fanya nini i think after all maisha ni yangu mm weshugulika na yake <laughs> and then i think kama huyo mtu si drug dealer si ako too decent ako sawa but the, the, the only thing is that anado kama unampenda stick with the person na si what parents this the fifth testament says woman is the fourth obey your father and mother <laughs> well obey your father and mother yeah. i have obeyed them but it, it, this is it, this is a part of like uh, my my life unajua i am already grown up i can make decisions i know right and wrong mm. as as long as huyu mtu anipeleke kwa the wrong way then i stick with the person because i love him mm. upendo ni upendo tu uta uta choose ku disobey parents upendo ni jambo mimi nitampenda mimi nitampenda it doesn't Uko matter parents me i have parents uh-huh. but i don't think parents one has influence relationship yako uh-huh. but it's good to listen unajua pia wenyewe wamekuwa na age lazima usikize argument yao iko aje argument za most of the time mm. kwa to that guys poor ama kitu ama <laughs> tribe eh umeona nini kwake eh yeah, ama tribe umeona nini kwake and then most of the time they have options for you wanakuambia, even if they have options they, they na, mm-hmm. we have a friend in Limuru very rich the son is in the university of nairobi taking law mm. and uh, we want to hook you with that man that is we know you know nothing about love you are the people who know you since you were born so we know what's good for you so you are going to marry hilary is a good guy achana na hicho kwa rauna kuja naye hapa hiyo i think hiyo ni kitambo you don't think it happens nowadays Okay it happens as she's saying eh nini yeah. uh, as in love is between the both of you it's between you and the guy so whichever factors are coming in those are third party including your own parents including your sisters including your brothers mm. number two, mkipendana lazima kuna huyo mtu hata ikupenda hata wazazi wakupenda kuna maybe brother sister ama anti hata ikupenda oh. so what what really matters is the love between you and him aye yes. atapasavia hiyo pressure wewe utapasavia hiyo pressure ya mapero mm. but mkishapendana hakuna hata wazazi wenyewe waezi wa separate you wanted to say something yeah. ni najua ni, ni, ni jambo linatokea kwa muda mrefu wakati kwa sababu tukiangalia katika upande linaotokea Mombasa ili ni jambo linatokea sana sana kwenu ya upande wa Mombasa <laughs> <laughs> unapata kuwa wazazi wame umemaliza shule yeah. wazazi wameshakutafutia mtu oh sasa yani ni lazima um, umkubali yule mtu yeah. kwa sababu wamekutafutia wanakwambia yeah. ni mtu mzuri so, wanaangalia standard wanaona yule sisi tumeshakutangulia na hata wengine wanasomeshwa na hao watu wao yeah mzazi anakuambia huyu ni mtu mzuri na huyu mtu ana take responsibility mpaka anaanza kusomesha anaanza yeah. kutoa pesa yeah. so kimaliza shule unapata uko na mtu tayari na ni mkubwa sasa una uko hapo tu like lazima ukubali tu <laughs> so kwa sababu an, wanasema si tushakula pesa yake ameshakusomesha hizo hizo vitu zingine si hata kikuja lazima tu ukubali uolewe na huyu mtu unaona sasa ina end up una, unakuwa na mtu wrong mwenye hata uko umjui you start starting creating bonds zenye aziko and labda wewe jamal ni you are a fourth wife yeah, yeah. 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 na ni lazima tu ukubali hii I, kitu ni in, in, kitu inatendeka kweli <laughs> nimeiona Mombasa inatendeka paka msichana anatoroka yeah. hataki ku is there anything you can do about it now that you educated and uh, all that me I, i just think like uh, educating the girl child is is very important mm. that they have the, the authority to say no okay yeah the, you have the, you have the power to say no okay. if you don't want something just say no 
and nothing will happen. Mzazi wako hezi kukuwa kwa sababu umesema no. Mm. Sidani kama kuna mzazi ya takudunga kisu kwa sababu umesema staki. Mm. Lakini ukiridhia na wao kuwa mm. ni sawa. Mm. Basi itakuwa sababu. Ni wewe mwenye umejitakia. Kwa sababu hakuna mtu aneza kuambia nataka uingia kwa hii shimo. No, na wewe kama utaki ukaingia. Mm. Mm. Kama utaki sema staki na ubaki kuwa staki. Good Kuzi. lesson. Yeah. Mm. Good lesson. Let's come back to standards. Looks. Luku, does it matter how he looks like when he approaches you? Do, do you care how he looks? Yes. Like where you can standard yako na yaya na kaivi hivi? Eh, me to me, luku luku ni muhimu. Eh. Luku luku ni muhimu. Like kama mtu wame kwa approach na kona looks na kaa cheap, utakata? Eh, eh. Luku luku may think it's important kwa sababu, squeezy kaesu, it's about how you present yourself. Mm -hmm. Unona? Sasa mtu wakikuja enye kusema ukweli ya mekuvalia vingine. Unona? Eh. Yeah. Eh. Unona uta, utasikia pana. Na si labda alikuwa amenda shamba. Kujana <laughs> kama amenda shamba. Amenda. Sasa siyo sali jua mna kuja kumit mdate. Hakuna tu vile unaza labda muambie I want you to change your wardrobe. I want it to be this way. We una reject tu kwa kukuona kumuona mara ya kwanza tu wati vile ya me analuku. Apana sija sema hivo. Yeah. Nimesema luku luku ina depend. Unajua pia uneza dunga ngo za mtush na ziko, sta, ziko sawa. Mm. Eee. Hey. Unajua wenye wakona pesa vizuri sana hata labda sa zingine ya wavaivi expensive. Sindu hiyo sasa. But you girls look at like outside. Dio face malu tuya hiyo jaju jamaa kupoa ni mkubali mm -hmm. ama this guy is poor. Luku luku may think it's something that someone should look nice. Lazimu akai poa dunge kakolo ni vizuri ni hey. nini ni, ni, unona. Hey. Yes. You are comment about looks. Mm, I think looks matter. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu mtu <laughs> tuna tuna tunaweza kuwa tuko pamoja oh. na aya sasa mimi nimekuja nimevaa hapo vizuri wewe sasa umekuja ume umevaa viatu ziko huko ya boebo so we are working together it, it's just uh, not, not yeah it's, it's, yeah, it's uh, not it's looks worrying. looks matter and in, in this generation mm. what you wanna represent mm. yeah, personally like even you una dress nini hivyo uwezi kukuja tu for example you are coming in the office and then unakuja umevaa slippers juu na but you looks matter that's why you're dressing up well mm. Mm. because looks matter mm. yeah. but it's not easy for men especially most men like our our jelly how they look a man can repeat longi hata mara tano jelly and the same man can bathe even twice a week it's okay with them wana wana kama hiyo si shida i don't know whether you can help raise the standard of a man eh, when it comes to looks me, I will. As we've said, looks matters. So if I see you are not meeting the looks that I want, hmm. lazima tungangane, tumuldiane, mpaka ufike hiyo standard. Hmm. Kama ni jeans, hmm. maybe tununue zingine. Hmm. Kama ni... I love tununue fresh. Like, <laughs> unaweza kuja tuna some sweet case useme. Hizi ni jeans ni mekuletea. So please, yes. going forward, yes. utakuna vaizi jeans. Yes, I mean we are in this together. We've met even women who don't know how to cook. And wanafunzwa na, na chali kupika. So it's a two-way thing. Because mm. nimeyamua kufall in love na wewe, mm. na naona ujui kuva. Mm. Nena na nunua, na ku, mm. pole, 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 pole. Mi sijui maybe kupika, unanifunza, najua kupika. Mm. Ivo, ivo, mnaundana. Kuna zabadilisha luksi zake? Yeah, definitely naeza kwa sababu, uh, mwanamuke ni kiungo kikubwa sana kwa mwanaume. Mm. Kwa hivyo, kama mimi nita simama na ye, mm. hata kama alikuwa na vavipi, mm. nita msaidia, mm. ili aeze kuimarika zaidi. Mm. Tunaeza tukatafu, nika mwambia, e, eh, unajua, vile umevaa, sioni. Hata kama, hata, pia, si lazima umuambie mm. directly. Mm. Unaweza umlete t-shirt, hey. unamletea trouser. Ajue, eh, unatakavai. Kwa ke, ataona ni upendo. Lakini kwa ko, unajua kwa, unambadilisha. Mm. Unajua? Mm. Kwa ko, ni, kwa ke ni upendo. Mm. Kwa ko, unajua chenye unafanya, unajua hey. unambadilisha. Kwa sababu, kuna ono mwengine, unukianza kumambia, eh, misipendi vinyo unavaizo viatu, misipendi vinyo una... 
unajua mm. anaona ni kama unaanza kumdarau mm. kwa hivyo unapomletea kiatu unamwambia nimekuletea zawadi yeye atavaa kwa upendo mm. lakini unajua kuwa unamtu, unamtunza na unamtunza na unabadilisha yeah. yeah. oh nice now give me a closing remark here by talking to uh, a lady who is focused on getting a rich educated person she's not stopping to anything but that anataka mtu rich mtu educated ongea na yeye okay, okay. okay. Uh, kama kuna mwanamke anataka mwanaume ambaye ni rich educated wapo lakini sidani kama education na uh, richness matters in life the only thing that matters is the uh, the attitude the behavior what is the man uh, taking you as unajua unaweza pata mwenye ambaye ako na richness all the richness but anaku treat vibaya anaku mistreat inakuwa domestic violence every day so richness and education for me i think the ladies outside there doesn't matter but as you choosing your partner unafaa uko unajua kuwa huyu ni mtu mtakaa na yeye pamoja kwa hivyo hata kama ako na elimu ako na pesa lakini anaku treat vipi anakubeba vipi anakutunza anakuheshimu anaku kama mambo kama hayo hawezi kunini ku, ku kuzingatia basi aufai kwa na mwanaume kama huyu kwa hivyo richness and uh, education it doesn't really matter in a re- okay. relationship thank you yeah. talk to girls talk to girls please okay may i say to all the girls out there you should know yourself that is the first thing before even meeting that rich woman before uh, sorry rich man before meeting that educated man i'd say just know yourself and know what you want because if you know what you want either akuwe rich akuwe poor akuwe ana gari akuwe ako na gari you will know what you especially know you will know how to love him if you know how to love yourself hizo mm. vitu zingine zitakuja kama unajijua cuz mm. kama unajijua you won't allow such things to happen mm. yes that is all uh, i can say as i summarize uh, these girls have told us here that standards are okay they are good you need to know your class and all that but don't get into a pit just because of them and you can make a man you can make a man out of nothing akuye mtu so mimi pia nangojea mtu tu akuje ani make yes it's nice you are coming back with uh, faith mutsoli to kill it mm